quick pasta salad. You can use this as a base to basically make any pasta salad. You're going to add a little bit more um, of the dressing, maybe, depending on how much you're going to make. I'm doing a small batch. So we're using, we're just kind of eyeing it. Okay, we're not going to measure these. We're just kind of eyeing it with the basic ingredients, but you get the idea. Follow me here. Mayo. <clears throat> Dijon mustard. Or you can use yellow if you don't like Dijon. Or, or honey mustard. Any of them will work. We're going to use, I have my own seasoning here. This is uh, it's a little bit of Italian seasoning. Garlic powder, onion powder, salt, pepper. I saved myself time. I kind of put all my favorite seasonings in one bottle, shake it up, and this goes on most of my stuff, so I can just grab it real quick in a pinch and not have to grab so many seasonings. So salt, pepper, a little bit more salt and pepper. And I like to get those little packets of the ranch dressing, the ranch seasoning mix, and um, I get them for like 50 cents usually around from Aldi's, and this will fill up two packets. So this is ranch seasoning mix. I just, you know, give it a little bit of kick of that. Kids love that. And I added on a lot of dishes that I cook with. So there's a little tip. And I have um, taco seasoning like this too. Because I like to season dishes with it randomly. <clears throat> oh, losing my voice. Okay. Then just adding a little bit of really fine chopped onion. Um, I did not have any red, but if you have red onion, green onion, any can work. A little bit of celery. Um, this is chop it up real tiny, really small bites, okay, for pasta salad, but it gives it a little bit of a crunch that's nice, or you can skip it out if you don't like it, but then we're going to come in with a little bit of sugar. I don't think I need that much if I was making a bigger, so I'm just going to kind of add in as much as I like. Then, I'm going to grab my pasta. I boiled up a... Uh, about a cup of elbow macaroni and then we're going to add a little bit of instead of um, vinegar you can do apple cider vinegar or if you have pickles add a little bit of the pickle juice <laughs> or um, you can do relish if you like relish um, I'm going to actually get a just regular like how Quick and easy as this, mix real good and just cover and store in the fridge until dinner time. But you can add and use this as a base and you can add in frozen peas, um, any kind of veggies you like really. You can add in um, little pepperonis and cheese. I love adding pepperoni and cheese for the kids sometimes. I'm just going to do it plain tonight because we're doing barbecue. Uh, pork loin and I got some baked beans and we're gonna do it with this that way I was thinking about macaroni and cheese but that way I don't even have to cook anything later like everything's gonna be done I really just gotta heat up the baked beans win-win I'm gonna cover this and throw it in the fridge make it